I'm Emily, and I'm gonna walk you from header to footer, top to bottom of customizing your AI-generated website. Let's get started. The starting point is your dashboard. In the GoDaddy Arrows section under Customized Website, select View Site to replace your Coming Soon page with a full website. If you've started this prior, it'll say Edit Site. A preview of your AI-generated site displays. Select Continue to refine your site. At this point, if you don't have a website plan, you'll have the option to make your purchase. I'm going to purchase the basic website. I can always upgrade later if I need to. I'm going to use the credit card I have on file and buy it now. Next, select the sections that you want on your website. We'll make recommendations for you based on the type of business that you have. I'm going to add an introduction and a calendar, then continue to my site. Let's take the tour. It shows you that you can change the color and design, add new sections to your page, you can customize your site's navigation, and of course, you can publish. Let's start by choosing a theme, which is the overall look and feel of the site. Select Try a New Look and choose the one you like. This won't change any content on your site. Now you can customize colors, select a matching color, or choose something from the color palette. The preview window will update in real time. If you already have brand colors, enter the hex code. You can also choose your preferred font. Each of these font sets have a primary and secondary font type. And if you want to change the button style, you can do that too. Let's jump back over to the home page by selecting Website. Here you can see your home page in the preview window and the edit pane on the right. As we scroll through the sections, everything highlighted can be edited and changed with or without using AI to help. Let's start editing the site content, starting with the header. Select the header in the preview window to open the edit pane. Select Cover Media. This is where you can rotate, delete, or change the image. This is the media library where you can add your own image, use stock media by searching, or use an image from any of your connected social media platforms. I'm going to use a stock image and then select Insert. If you don't like the header that AI generated for you, you can select the text you want to update and then Get Copy Suggestions. You can select Suggest Another Option until you find what you like and then select Use This Suggestion. You can always type your own text in the preview window. Now change the text on the button by selecting it. I want mine to say See Schedule and when people select it, I want them to be taken to the event section. Select Done when finished with the header. The About section is next. Let's select the About section to open the pane on the right. If you don't like the layout, you can change it. I'm going to choose this one. Now you're ready to edit the section groups. You can select the group you want to edit, and just like the header, you can get copy suggestions or type what you want. We don't have facilities, so I'm going to delete this group by choosing Trash and then Delete. Let's move on to the next section, which is a photo gallery. I'll leave these images for now and update with my own photos later. Next is the introduction section, and I want to move it below the header. You can use the arrows to move the section up or down on the page. That looks good. Now to update the text and button link. Select Done when ready to move on. Let's edit the events section to list upcoming events. The default is to link to a calendar from another source, but you can change that to add your events manually. Now edit the fields to customize your event. To add another event, select Add and enter the event information. The next section down is Contact Us. I'm going to update the text and remove the hours. That looks good. Let's move on to the social section. Update the header and add links to your social sites. I don't want people to subscribe just yet, so I'm going to delete this section by selecting the menu and choosing Delete Section and then Delete. Our homepage is now ready to be published and made available for the world to see. The last thing to do is publish to make the site live. And that's how you customize your AI-generated website. Go ahead and share with family and friends to gather feedback. You can always make edits and publish again. Now go customize your site.